Hey everyone, come join me for this challenging knee hook drill conditioning workout. So we're gonna do this together. We'll begin with the pull on the left side, hands above. Arms can be bent or straight. We'll invert with the pull on the left side and really lift those hips with straight legs. Let's hook the right knee. Keep the hips lifted as you open up to straddle and then hook the left knee. Keep lifting as we straddle one more time. Keep those legs nice and straight. Hug the arms in and slowly dismount, feet to the floor. So from the ground, we'll move the pole now to the right side of the body and repeat the same drill. Invert, exhale, lift your hips. We'll hook the right knee first, straddle, lift the hips and hook the left knee. Straddle, and then with straight legs, keep lifting through the core, lower the legs slowly down. Now let's bring this into same side knee hook theory. So with the fabric on the left side of our body, we'll invert and hook the left knee. Do a big sit up, bringing your nose to your knee, climb up left hand leading, Lifting your hips, shoot the left leg down and scissor with the right leg squeezing over on top of left. Swim both knuckles underneath the tail, grab the pole and drop your hips and legs towards the floor. Rewrap, dismount, we'll do the other side. Same side knee hook with the pole on the right now means everything will be on the right. Invert, lift those hips, hook the right knee. Big sit up, nose to knee, right hands begins, then left. Shoot the right leg down, scissor the legs left on top, squeezing hard. Tilt into your hip key and swim knuckles underneath the fabric to hip key. Grab the pole, drop the hips and legs and rewrap to slowly climb back down. When you're ready, let's go to opposite side knee hook. We're gonna explore this in a couple different ways. Pull on the left, right knee hooks, lift those hips. The first variation we'll do is keeping that gazelle position in the body, the right arm will swim for the tail, bring it to the shoulder. Climb up and over, fabric in that right shoulder, come into the hip key and release your silk. Again, grabbing pull, we'll dismount, rewrap and climb on down. So if that variation is too difficult, what I love to do is a variation called clean the dirt off your butt. This variation, again, pull on my left, I'll straddle, lift the hips really high and hook the right knee above the hands. Bring the nose to the knee and take the right arm and swim for the tail behind your back. Think of your sacrum. Then pull up and over with that tail in the right shoulder into your right side hip key. This is a great remedial movement to do when you're having a hard time maintaining your gazelle as you swim back for the tail. One more version, the hardest one, is to invert and never get the tail. Lift the hips and keep climbing, squeezing your knees together into a tuck and then pulling up and over into your hip key. You may wanna work on getting to this point in your practice. So now that we've done that side, the pull on the left, we will of course will move with the pull onto the right side body. Here we go. Invert, lift those hips, left leg hooks, swim that left arm from your gazelle and get that fabric into the armpit. Climb up and over, leading with the left hand into a left side hip key. Again, if that was too difficult, go into the cleaning the dirt off your butt variation. If you wanna make it harder, simply don't ever use your hands to swim for the tail. Pull up and tuck into your left side hip key. Great job, please let me know how you did.